Welcome, it's Facts You Don't Know. If it's your first time here and you want to find out new facts that will definitely make you smarter and more. Well, and for make sure to subscribe and active the notification bell so you don't miss anything. We just wanted to give her everything. We held a birthday party, prom and wedding ceremony for a five-year-old cancer and a dying girl. Leela May Squo is a sweet, sweet girl, five years old. Unfortunately, in September 2012, she was diagnosed with neuroblastoma cancer. When the cancer was noticed, it was in the fourth phase. Neuroblastoma is a nervous system-born cancer that carries messages from the brain to the whole body. It is the most common solid tumor out of the skull among childhood cancers and the most common cancer in infancy. 50% of the neuroblastoma cases are children under two years of age and in infancy. Lila's biggest dream was to join the ball as a princess and become the favorite princess of a big party. That is why her family has been in Lila since the fourth stage of neuroblastoma diagnosis. They wanted to have a big birthday party. For this, the Buter Bank building was decorated like a big castle. Even brightly armored knights were prepared. It was no different from the castle in the fairy tales. On July 31st, her fifth birthday, everyone gathered to give her a birthday party like a princess. She arrived at the Butler Bank building, which was turned into a castle for her, with a fantastic cart as planned. While her father was accompanying her on the red carpet, she looked like a princess with a magic wand touched amongst the family members and hundreds of guests who watched her. Her mother wanted to prepare a big party for Lila because Lila would never go to the prom or never get married. Because cancer was at its final stage, and according to doctors, Lila had a few months of life. Lila's biggest love was her father, just like any young girl. So at that party for Lila, her father fell on his knees and offered to realize Lila's biggest dream and marry her. We don't know how much time she has left and will stay with us. But we just want to resist with all our strength. We want to give her everything she deserves, said her father. July 31st should have been a fantastic tale, not just a birthday for Lila. While blowing the cancer fighting Lila candles since September 2012, her mother and father, who always tried to stay strong, were with her. Lila and her father danced the fairies jealous of them in front of hundreds of guests. Her biggest dream is to celebrate her birthday in a prom mood among colorful dresses and dancing people. I want to complement this with a few more good ideas. Lila's mother, Heidi Hall, in July before the party for Lila said, My little princess is turning five on July 31st, and it's probably her last birthday. Had reported the date of her birthday on Facebook's pages. And her mother said that this party is as beautiful as a dream she never wanted to wake up from. People also supported campaigns, including costumes, feud, and music, with their ad campaign. After the Facebook page was set up, a lot of help was made from the food aid to the Cinderella costume for Lila's birthday to be complete. Lila's birthday party wasn't really a Disney fairy tale. All the princesses came together for her. I couldn't keep my tears when Lila said she was the most popular princess at her birthday party. It was very important for me to see her happy and witness that she felt special. Thank you to everyone who prepared this special day. It is not easy to struggle and survive when the conditions are so difficult. It was almost impossible to fight without the help of all the people. You played a big role in the smile of a little girl. We also wish Lilac healing to Lila. We hope that on many birthdays and parties like this, she becomes the beautiful princess that no one can see with her eyes. We hope once again you will value a magic wand and you will be healed, Lila. All our prayers are with you. Thanks for watching. Please like and share the video in social networks. We'll be right back to you as fast as we can.